All that just to get the one ribbon. The hell? Central Operations, F380. Is that... Oh, that's a Fathom. I might as well grab this to make it stop whispering. Stop whispering at me! Nothing? Okay. Pinwheel Post, May 1st, 1970. Mayday Street Party, huge success. Annual pil pinwheel celebrations see crowds of people take to the streets, enjoy festivities, food, and fun. Visitors from around the Pinwheel and Devlin area travel to the traditional May Day festivals that were held in Pinwheel Village this bank holiday weekend. Many events were held around the village in key areas such as Pinwheel Harbor, Pinwheel Primary School, as well as the Pinwheel's Village Square. After the May Day disaster of 1966, it is a delight to see the village bustling once more. Well, that's nice. New operation. After much discussion, it has been decided that an expansion will occur to our current tunnel structure. Untapped rock that lurks underneath the coastline and sea can be accessed through the Brimcliff depths, which is a potential jackpot for tin. As I am sure you are all well aware, Brimcliff is currently experiencing a difficult time financially and on and an operation like this could potentially turn business around. A drilling operation will commence on April 29th, 1966, and will require all miners to be present throughout the initial weekend to begin work. If anyone has any comments or issues, please come and see me in my office. In his office means most likely this was the warden. So they're operating on their assumption of more profit. So greed killed people. Not really a surprise. All right, Fathom 380. Let's go do that thing. I don't know how to fix this yet, so I'll come back to it. Can I just take this out of the wall? Nope. Okay. So, one, two, three, and... Boop, 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 boop. Ha, ha. Please come this way. The doctor oh. will see you now. Does that bring up this? Yay! That looks rickety as all hell. I don't want to step on it. Okay. What the hell? Let me put the knocker back and I'll be right back. Kind of collecting them. Now, can I play it on the uh, projector downstairs? Or... Is it going to be something else entirely? No. Something else entirely. Alright, I'm going to put it somewhere for safekeeping. Mm, over here. Boop. Just in case. Time off forbidden! Dear Mr. Peterson, I am writing to notify you that your recent holiday request from May 1st, 19, 1966 has been refused due to Mr. T. Fletcher already being on holiday. Oh, that's why he survived. He was at the May Day Festival. An expansion of the mine tunnels is needed and it required that you attend work on this day, Warden. Well, why did Thomas get it off if it was forbidden? The test results back. It's what we thought. The early stages of dementia. Yeah. If we act now, there's a strong chance we can delay the onset of symptoms. I'll be honest with you. Treatment is expensive, especially without the right kind of insurance. But with the right care, there's a strong chance of you having a relatively normal life in the short term. We've had similar cases where patients react positively to all of the treatments we have. So now there, I don't know if this is because we got so many um, projectors beforehand. It's kind of cut and dry. Thomas has dementia. However, we still don't know anything about, well, anything, whether this is actually a treatment, which most likely he's not delving into somebody else's mind, or if... Uh, I'm going to be out of contact for a while now, but don't panic. I'll be back shortly. Okay, Th thanks for telling me that, although you kind of already did. Um, Gene, right? Jeez, I'm a horrible person. But um, his wife, Jean, we always hear her as very young. So it is possible that Thomas got dementia very young. If you, Oh, there's some more depths. 
I'll have to remember that. Um, if he got it very young, that makes sense. But if he got it at, when he was older, he's hearing Jean at a time where he uh, was probably most in love with her. And nothing again. This is getting de uh, disconcerting. Hey, I got lots of those. You want to see my shelf? <laughs> lots of bulbs. Just, yeah. Some of them are broken, but they're mine. <laughs> Equipment request. Kenneth L. Request item. Three drill pieces for hard rock that was encountered at 38 fathoms. Reason. Whilst digging one of the new tunnel systems, we encountered a dark, tougher rock. When we attempted to use our current drilling equipment on the rock, the drill had bent and warped out of shape, rendering them unusable. We need stronger equipment that is more versatile if we are to continue searching effectively for new veins, as I cannot continue repairs this often. Evidence is very strong that the past that past these rocks that a tin or copper vein may exist. Well, wouldn't that be wonderful? Also, the ocean might exist past that, which would be bad. Can I go down here? I'm gonna bring out my light. Cause that has a light. Yeah, hello. Ooh, that looks ominous. Hello, hello, hello. Nothing, okay. That was um fruitful. Can I get under here? I cannot. That's probably a good thing, because I don't want to get under there. I get in there. That would be disconcerting, to say the least. Knockers in the depths. I don't like going down into the depths. Something just isn't normal about that place. It's not called the Devil's Lap for no reason, and I can tell you right now, there are things down there. Things that don't want to be discovered. I've heard knockers down there. Grumpy mind creatures that like to torment us when they feel like it. I've heard voices where no man goes, and I've seen wisps that try to guide you the wrong way. Mining ain't for the faint-hearted. Sean V. Well, sure. We'll go with that. Right, I don't want to go down there yet. There might be knockers! Strange rock. I was down in the depths again today. The stink of the unknown flooded the cavern. An air of the past can be felt on the back of your neck. Okay, that's a weird way to put it. The only sound to accompany us in the echoes of our work and the and the canaries tweeting away. Hopefully the wait, the only sound to accompany us in is the echoes of our work and the canaries tweeting away. Wow. Hopefully never stopping. Recently we have been uncovering this strange rock as we dig the new expansion under the sea. A blue crystal that emits the faintest of light. It reminds me of something real and makes me wonder whether any of this exists around us. I struggle to remember the last time I left this place. A ghost or memory, perhaps. I'm unsure, but the rock sure is beautiful. Wow, that throws into questions whether all these, any of this is even partially memories or all in his head. Hello, son. Answer phone again? Really? <laughs> okay. It was really good talking to you last week. I missed that. We've heard this before. We've, we've I'm gonna have to go back and find it. Visiting. Or maybe somehow you could come to us. Anyway. Let me know. Taste salt and sugar before use. Uh, okay. Well, let's just go to the industrial center. I'm gonna go this way. Maybe it'll unlock it. Not that I need to, unfortunately. Yeah, it just opens up. Perfect. All right, ooh. Please don't make the water rise. All right. So we are missing one answer machine. I'm gonna have to go back and find that. And that should be fairly easy. Those don't tend to bug out like everything else in this game. Yeah. I kind of rushed through the village knowing what to do with everything, trying to get things working. But, um, yeah. I must have gone too fast. Oh, I could just, it says it right here now, which that's going to be easier. Well, I want to go down into the depths. Man, this place is open. Is that a painting? The painting of a miner. That is very strange. Alright. 
Let's just climb down, shall we? How the hell do I get up there? Is there a plaque or something? Painter's Journal, number four. I got very confused at the art group today. I wanted to paint a picture based upon my experience at Brimcliffe Mine and Pinwheel. But my teacher told me that maybe I should try a, subject, a different subject area. I hadn't painted anything to do with Brimcliffe Mine, and she showed a huge amount of disrespect towards me and my experiences. I lost friends in that mine. I lost a future family member. I will admit, I shouldn't have lost my temper, but it upset me. I was asked if I would step outside and calm down. I feel much better now, and I must have painted that picture as it hung up on my wall in my room. A future family member? From the way he worded that, and I could be reading into this, a future family member would be somebody that you marry. So is Jean dead. And she's been dead since he was young. And he remarried. Obviously because of his son. So Thomas is older and at more at a normal, quote unquote, normal time for dementia. And now he's living in his past. Are we helping him or not? Because his obsession with saving his, I, I'm assuming now, fiancé at the time. Might be um, sending him further and further down um, into the depths of dementia. Can I drop down there? Um, I'm going to do something really, you know, smart and save. So, you, you know, j j just in case. Okay, it's an invisible wall. I wanted to be safe. Okay, I'm going to try the other fathoms. Maybe I can come out like over there. Oh, wait. See that? I see that. I see that. Uh, hello. There we go. <laughs> Whoa. That worked. That worked really well. I'm assuming how his son would take this, though, because he's basically in his dementia talking about a woman that is not his mother. Okay, so here are the personal items that you asked for. Excellent. Thank you. Have you dated them with the description labels I gave you? Of course. I went through it all. It, it, it should be pretty accurate. Good. This will be a great help. Um, how, how is he actually doing? I... I just want to... Treatment is ongoing, Mr. Fletcher. You know that. But I'd, I'd really like to see him. Come back tomorrow, and I'll ensure that you get to spend some time together. But for now, visiting hours are over. Alright. Sounds like one we've already listened to. I think because I, I listened to him backwards the second time through. Is this the last one? I don't think it is. Hopefully I didn't miss one. I don't think I did. So there's one more. Hmm. Hey, that's a knocker. Harry walked with his head slightly low and without making eye contact. Please don't hate me, Rob. Andrew made me do it. Rob shoved the lamp at Andrew. I don't hate you, Harry. Let's just get the hell out of here. Just then, Rob stopped in his tracks. Shh! Everyone! What was that noise? It's not gonna work, Andrew sighed. No, seriously, said Rob. I heard something. The brothers stood for a moment and listened. A pained groan whistled through one of the tunnels, connected to the main passageway. Oh, crap, shouted Rob. Tell me that's you again, Andy. Andrew's face dropped. No, that's nothing to do with me. Suddenly, knocking and banging three times louder than before, and moaning and yelling spilled from the mine, getting closer and closer. That's real, Andrew cried. Harry grabbed hold of Rob's arm. What are we going to do? Yeah. 
the knock is gonna get you. He gonna get you. I think there's only eight of them, so I should only have one left. So far, so good. I don't know, AI shutdown? 